Well, hello there, and welcome to In My Mailbox. And I'm making it for last week. I was on vacation, so this is for week five and six. Let's get to it. Um, I uh, was the lucky recipient of a, of a rack from Malia. At the uh, reading is the ultimate aphrodisiac. She was kind enough to send me Hounded. Hounded is the first book in the Iron Druid Chronicles by Kevin Hearn, I believe. Um, let's just, all I'm going to read the back is this. You got a sexy bartender possessed by a Hindu witch and some good old fashioned look of the Irish to kick some Celtic arse and deliver himself from it. Is it Celtic? I can never remember. Anyway, I think it's going to be lots of fun. Um, thank you so much, Maya, for your rack, and I will report back after I finish. Uh, next book, moving on supernaturally. Uh, this is the follow-up to Paranormal See Better, Dear Miss Kirsten White. Um, the first book was just so charismatic and charming and just fun. Uh, I hope that those elements continue in the second book, which I'm sure they will. So looking forward to this read and writing a review. I've been craving a little myth or mythology, uh, and I know there's quite a few reads out there right now that are centering, cent centering around um, an old myth. Uh, and I decided to go with Starcross because the cover is just gorgeous. I think it had the best reviews. Uh, Starcross by Josephine Angelini. The cover alone is, is, is a dead cell. Not that you should ever judge a book by a cover, but I definitely do. Uh, so this... <sighs> I'm ready. I'm ready for it. I think this might move up to the top of the reading pile. Just saying. Uh, the next couple of books I bought at Borders... Um, which is sad because they're closing, but not sad because they're on sale. So, 20% uh, off, you know, normal fiction isn't really anything because they're cheaper on Amazon. But when you're buying young adult paperbacks, it's a couple bucks. A couple bucks saved, you know what to say. Uh, first book is actually, I have not read the first book in the series, but I was so smitten with it when I read about it. It's uh, called The Riddle, and it's by Allison... Rogan, I believe. It's the second book of Pelinor. And I believe it's a saga at this point where there's four books out. Uh, I don't really know much about it, but it just, uh, it looks like it's going to be a solid a high adventure fantasy read, and I just can't get enough of those. Um, along with that same genre of high adventure fantasy, I've been really wanting to read Tamira Pierce. Uh, this is the first book of her Song of the Lioness, Elena. I think her books her books have been compared with Christian Kishore, and I love Christian Kishore, so bring it on. Um, two fairy books for this for this for this week's um, Wings by April and Pike. I actually had never heard of this until I saw Illusions come out a few months ago and I thought the cover was just enchanting. Uh, so I figured I'd give this a whirl, especially since Iron Faye is done, and I want, some, I want some fairy action. Another fairy story, but uh, and something I haven't ever found read before. It's called Merlin's Harp, and it's a lyrical retelling of the Arthurian cycle from the point of view of the fair folk. And uh, it's by Anne Elliot Crompton, and it's a gorgeous cover. Check this beauty out. I have no idea if it's good or not. <laughs> I didn't check it up on Amazon when I bought it. I just went with it, and I love me some uh, stories of Avalon and uh, Arthur, Camelot. Some of my favorite elements into a book. So here's hoping. Here's hoping. The last book. I feel like I'm the only person in the blogging world that has not read this darn book. Miss Rachel Hawkins, Hexhall. Uh, it's been on my to read list, to buy list forever. I was hoping I'd get it as a rack. But, uh, unless, uh, all of a sudden, here it is, and I love the cover. So fun. So, um, oh, oh, oh yes, I remember. This is a big moment for me. I received my first net galley picks. I was actually approved to read The Iron Knight. Oh, um, finished, loved it. I actually cried, I think. <laughs> and, uh, the I, no, 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 The Iron Knight, yes. Trizan Izzy which I started and I'm having mixed feelings about, and the Juliet spell. Uh, so that's what I have so far. That was what's been going on these past two weeks in my mailbox. And uh, I think it's going to sum it up for now. What about you? What did you guys get in your mailbox?